Hello YouTube, it's Balmore here, back bringing more blind gaming. This is part 7 of The Evil Within. So new series that I started after we did Resident Evil Revelations to get myself into the YouTube gaming community, you know, get myself my wheels grease so to speak uh, bring, when I start bringing the new content, upcoming stuff. So anyways, recap. Last part, we went ahead, we entered this new chapter, The Claws of the Horde. We got to a cutscene where we had to open, um, half the little village here was blocked by, you know, these gates with spikes. Couldn't get through. So we opened that up. There's baddies all around. We've been stealthy sneak killing so far. And the doctor's luring the zombies off while I have to go find Leslie, the mental patient who's some key point uh, person in this game. So, here's the barn. Let's see if we can get in here. And I cannot. I do not want to be in the open. As you can see, there's an eyeball above me, which means somewhere near me, at least the guy having the panic attack is uh, close. So, it means enemies are close. And I'm hearing chains. Got this axe, have no idea what it's gonna do. I didn't see anybody up here, but I'm being cautious. I don't know how many parts this is gonna be broken into, but just wanna play it carefully. Oh yeah, kick the door right in. It's very, very, very lit. I do not like that. <laughs> my, my son likes to do that when I do that. Just share a little something about myself. I don't see anybody, but... God, that guy is creeping me out. There's a ladder going up. For now, let's... Not... There's a bear trap. Ladder there. Parts are always good. Uh, oh, kick. I guess that ladder was not down. It must be like a back door somewhere. Let's keep exploring up here. just don't feel safe every time I see that eyeball. Somebody's close. I don't think I'm making enough noise. Oh, you know what? I wonder if they're down below me. I wish you could pick up that sledgehammer. Dying light sledgehammer was great. Guess there's that down. Nope, that's already. Uh, let's kind of stay up this way. Oh, more boxes. Now, if I played full game throughs before I started playing these things, I'd definitely be able to go through a lot faster because I know where everything is. But I, don't know, I, I feel it takes away from the whole um, experience of the game. There is a tr What the hell was that? Did you guys hear that? Ah, there it is. Oh, that was close. Woo! I did blow one of those suckers up. Highly unpleasant. It's a bottle. Okay, I hear a regular zombie somewhere. Oh, there's that guy that's making all the racket. I think he's chained up or something. Because you can hear chains going. I guess he's a little... A little piss, as I said, Mr. Angry Pants over there. <laughs> I 
I'm sure he he would not want me calling him Mr. Angry Pants. All right, let's go up here. I feel that'll be safest at this moment. Can't drop off there. Oh, another one of those keys. So this is like a little secret area. I mean, not really, but whoops. missing a lot of bullets that I could be picking up because I don't have the uh, clip capacity. Oh wow, you can see him clearly right there-ish. Let me go up a little bit so you guys can see him. Yeah, he's chained up, he's pissed, and I doubt I get anywhere near him. He's gonna, oh, I broke my chains. Alright, so the most viable thing I can think of was I kicked a ladder down here. So I have a feeling this is kind of my... Uh, what I need to do to sneak around the best. I could go guns blazing, but... I don't like to... What is that? Is that a uh, trap? Never tell. We're going to go through here. That's lit up. That goes downstairs. Oh, another one? They all fucking saw me. Yeah, crap. Go, 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 go. gone down there first and would have seen him. I just had like, they just unloaded on me. So half my health is gone just from that little fiasco. But at least that's it. That's all I got alerted. Fire time on the gun is, uh, fire rate is awful. Just awful. I think there's really. Oh, I can kind of look around here. Gotta figure out how to get out of that view. This was the uh Is there another one over here? No, 
Nope. Oh, um, that's that ladder. I think I kicked down over there. down this way. I think this is... Oh, yeah. Okay. It's locked now. Which is interesting. Looking to see any of those bullets that I had to bypass. Alright, we kind of looped around. go back and upgrade but I'm gonna hold out I don't think I need to upgrade my gun yet I'm hearing them so the thing is in there oh thank god I was slow walking Should have burned his ass. I think that was a grenade. Lots of yum yums. His ass is close. Frick is he? I wish there was a way to kind of see where they were, kind of a general location, but Where the frick is he? The sound in here creeps me out. It's like so close. Oh, maybe he's over there. Okay, so the eye's good here. Oh, there's a... Ah, look at that. I don't think anybody can see me. I don't know what's up here. I just thought it'd be pretty cool to go check it out. And <laughs> watch, it's going to be a zombie. Lots of goo. Well, that was nice of them. I don't see anything else. So, alright, we're on the little watchtower. Um, looks like they're near, but not near enough to see me because there's no eyeball on the top of my screen. So, I'm going to end it here. It's kind of cool little lamp sitting by me. Instead of starting the next part at the 
top here, I will climb down to the bottom and just do it that way. So, with the creepy zombie noise. Sounds like it's right behind me, breathing on my neck, but it's probably like 100 yards away. Anyways, guys, thanks so much for watching. I hope you guys enjoy this as much as me. I hope my experience uh, with the game makes you feel like you're right there because, uh, you know, that's how I would feel. But that's just me. Anyways, guys, until next time, later.